subscribe, click on the bell, like, like comment, comment, share. share. Yeah, man. We back at it again, my boy. Out in the Poconos, baby. And um, I got some stuff to talk about. I gotta get gas too. And I'm waiting for these mugs to uh. Anybody coming? No. Oh, okay. Watch out for this gravel here. We're about to go into twisties, y'all. Uh, all right. So this is what's coming up on this channel. This is what's coming up right now today. We, I'm gonna do a speed run on the highway. Do some high, uh, some pulls on a highway. Highway pulls. All right. And see how fast we could go without being scared. I gotta get gas. And also, um, I wanna. I got a rant. I just bought a GoPro 360. Uh, camera and not the GoPro Max, which is the, um, the, the the latest version, but I bought the version beforehand because I was being cheap. The Fusion, which is their first generation GoPro's first generation 360, and I had the vision of I'm riding with one camera and the other one. I I I, I uh, put in some like um, 360 uh, little inserts and stuff like views or whatever like that to try to take it to the next level with my vlogging. And I, they, first of all, GoPro gave up on this camera. There's no support for this camera since the Max came out. GoPro Max, which is their upgraded 360. And um, I'm very disappointed. I, my, my video software cannot render or process the 360 video. So it's like, I guess got a big paperweight. And to return it to Amazon seller that I bought it from, I got to print out this UPS label and you know, it's just, it sucks all around right now. So I'm going to try to watch some tutorials. There's a way I can like render the video on my phone and maybe kind of like transport it from there or something. I, I, I don't know, but I just feel like I got beat big time with this camera. I feel like I got beat with this camera. And uh, that's how I feel right now. So, you know, I'm a little disappointed. I feel like I wasted my money. I had to buy two SD cards for this thing, one for the front camera, one for the rear camera, which sucked. So I'm, I'm feeling some kind of way right now. As you can see, look on my right mirror right here. I got a mount, that was supposed to be for the 360 camera. But I'm just going to get a regular, faithful. I got a GoPro 8, no, a GoPro 6, excuse me. And I'm just going to rock another GoPro 6 or a GoPro 8, just a regular one, to get you just two of it. I'm just vlogging. I'm not doing nothing special or anything like that. So, But I wanted to take it to the next level without spending that GoPro Max money, which is their new 360 camera. But I'm going to spend $500 on some camera. I got a wife now, and I, I got things to do outside of this channel. You know what I'm saying? So... Um, that's how I feel right now, you know what I mean? That's how I feel. So, this is a little banter before we get to the highway. And I'm just taking the back road here, nice and scenic. I hope you guys like this. Um, hope the wind does not bother you. Please do not pull out in front of me. Thank you. Alright, so that's where we at right now. So, highway pools is coming up. If the video gets too long, I'm going to break it down into like uh, part one and part two. Um, I'm uploading Mondays and Fridays. I don't want to overdo it. I got to get back to the Muay Thai gym. They haven't seen me in like about a month. And I'm wasting money with that because I haven't been going. I, it's like I got to get my life together. I got to get my stuff together. The marriage is excellent. We good on that end. Job, we good on that end. It's just finding time for the Muay Thai practice and the vlogging and the writing. You know what I'm saying? So that's where we at right now. So uh, this is a sketchy turn. I think I'm supposed to go this way. Oh shoot. That was the sketchiest turn ever right there. Hey, I took that turn like a total novice. I was a noob, a brand newbie in on that turn. Yeah, Hebrew. Okay, anyway, what was I saying? Okay. 
um, highway runs coming up, some highway pulls. I do got to get gas. I have no gas gauge, which is the staple for me. I have I have never had a gas gauge in my life on any of the bikes I had. I started out on a Ninja 250 Kawasaki. Picture is right there. I think I'm going to put that in there. Then I graduated to a Harley Sportster. Oh, gravel, gravel, gravel. And I was trying to be about that Harley life. But that wasn't for me. It was a nice bike and everything. Classic, but not for me. And now I'm back with a sport bike with a bigger, better Kawasaki. 600. ZZR 600 to be specific. So yeah, that's where we are. All right, okay, okay. So enjoy the views here. There's a nice truck in front of me. Cool. Whatever. That's cute. Uh, I'm about to pass a lake up here, uh, which is nice. I would love to stop and take some pictures. Should I? I might, maybe on the way back, I don't know, we'll see, we'll see what the day unfolds, but yeah, this is a nice ride, man, this is a nice ride, I'm feeling good right now, I'm feeling stupendous, so yeah, uh, here's my Instagram, I'm down here, in case anybody cares. A lot of cool stuff on there. I keep my Facebook private. That's for like family in my inner circle. I don't give that out. But Instagram, I go nuts on there. Y'all come see me. That's the wild side of me. Oh, it's that family dollar truck. Obstructing the views of the twisty twisty turny turnies. Yeah, man. Kawasaki Diary hitting y'all up with another entry. Coming at y'all with some full highway blasting coming up. Oh, man. I gotta do so much. I gotta do a top five what I like about this bike. I gotta do a top five what I hate about this bike. So much material I have on deck lined up for y'all. So much material for the couple of people that watch this. Yeah, man. Oh, do I want to stop at the lake? Looks kind of crowded today. Ice. I should have stopped. I could have got right up on that lake and took me a picture. I should bust a U-turn. Anybody behind me? That would have been such a glorious picture. Maybe on the way back. Oh. That would be glorious picture too right there too. Oh, look at that y'all. I'm always checking my rear view mirror here to make sure nobody up on me. Make sure nobody up on a brother. Oh, that's a nice little cottage. One floor. Oh, that's cute. It's like a like a studio house. A studio apartment house. <laughs> How quaint. All right. Should I do it? All right. I'm going to do a top five right now. Top five things I love about this bike. Number one, for a super sport, it is comfortable. I mean, 
I, I, I've sat on the dealership on some bikes where I'm like way down here, you know what I'm saying? The handlebars are super low or whatever. And, I, and my, my butt is sticking up in the air like a cat in heat. I don't like that, my butt to be up in the air like that. I mean, I, I don't feel like too comfortable like that. And I can imagine like a block or two, I'll be ready to get off of that thing. And that bike, those bikes are designed for like straight up racing. They just happen to have headlights and blinkers to be street compliant. I'm not feeling that. This bike is a super sport, but it's very comfortable. The handlebars are low, but not insanely low. And the seat itself is very comfortable and plush. And the bike itself is kind of like, kind of chunky. And like the wind just goes around me. And I'm sitting pretty high. And I can see like over cars and stuff. I think it's more like a sport tourer. So uh, I guess all of that goes under comfort. That's what I like most about this bike. It's very comfortable. I feel like I could do long days on here. Just give me a saddle bag and a tail bag and I'm good. Throw my junk in there, I'm good for a weekend run. Let me see. Second thing I like about this bike, the pull and the torque. Oh my goodness. Like, you think V-Twins got pulled? Inline four, yo, it's smooth down low. And also it pulls too. And like, I'm riding, I, I ride around town in like second gear, third gear sometimes, you know what I'm saying? On the highway when I'm chilling, this car is about, I'm like in fourth gear, I'm chilling. You know what I'm saying? Um, hold up, I'm distracted here. Alright, we'll take the really scenic way. Yeah, uh, so much power, I don't need to shift. I could just like ride around in like fourth gear. Fourth gear does everything, street and highway. I could be lazy with this thing. Just be chilling in like fourth gear. I'm going like 75. I love that. Never experienced that before, but that's pretty nice. Uh, that's number two. Number three, what I like about this bike, um, Hold on, is this all gravel? Like, what is this? This road is sketchy, y'all, I apologize. Number three, what I like about this thing is like, it's a Kawasaki. I have a Kawasaki fetish. I don't know why Kawasaki is my favorite brand, but I just love Kawasaki and everything that they're doing. I love their color scheme with the green and everything. Uh, I think it's a good company. I don't like all of their bikes, but I don't know why. I just like Kawasaki. I can't explain it, it's just I like what I like. And um Yeah. And uh Okay, forget about it. Forget about the top five list. That's corny. We about to do some highway pulls. Y'all ready for some football? <laughs> I was just I was just buying time until I got to the highway. I don't care about no top five list. I was yanking y'all. This is what I really came here for. This is what I really came here for. I ain't tired of messing with y'all. Some top five list. Ooh, you, you, all think I'm, you all think I'm Psycho Cruiser? No. It's Kawasaki to the diary, y'all. About to punch y'all in the face with another entry. With lots of wind noise. That's how we coming. Roar. Hold on. Y'all ain't seen nothing yet. I'm just, I'm warming up. Y'all ain't seen nothing. That was some highway pulls. I'm gonna give y'all some highway pulls. All right, here we go. Highway pulls, go.
a good one. That was a good one. Yeah. Yeah, man. That was a good one. I was feeling that one. You get some gas. I had no gas gauge, so I gotta look at my uh, gas uh, uh, the, uh, trip uh, trip tripometer or whatever the heck you call it. I'm at 104 miles. So, uh, I'm not sure how much five gallons will get a brother, but I better be on the safe side. So, yeah, here we go. Yeah, I think she's thirsty. Top five list. <laughs> Nah, hold on, gas break, she good, she good.